the iRobot 670 series. This is Walmart's best-selling robot vacuum, and we're going to dive into the details of this vacuum, and maybe you can decide if this is the one for you. All right, so maybe you've been doing some online shopping or maybe you've been in the actual store and you've been in Walmart and you've seen this new robot called the Roomba 670. It's Walmart's best-selling robot vacuum. And let me tell you, it is a good vacuum. I have been using this thing for a little while now and I can testify to say that this is a great vacuum and it's done really well for me in the time that I've owned it. So in this video, I'm going to talk about the specifics on it, tell you all the details. That way you can make a decision on your own and see if this is the, the model that you want to get. I'll give you some test footage of this thing in action and tell you all about it. All right, so we live in a world of artificial intelligence where devices talk to us. When we talk to them, they talk back to us. And in today's video, we're going to talk about the iRobot Roomba 670 and how well it does with Amazon Alexa. And so when I bought the new iRobot Roomba 670 and realized how well it integrated with Amazon Alexa, I was really happy to see that I was able to turn on my robot vacuum with my voice and it works seamlessly. Point being, nobody's got time to be hauling around a vacuum every time somebody walks across their clean floor or one of the pets comes across and sheds all their fur on it. Nobody's got time for that. Probably because as soon as we get done vacuuming, we're walking all over our clean floors. Maybe the dumb cat is walking across and shedding her fur. Maybe the dog is scratching and shedding its fur, thus making our clean floor all dirty again. And this is the reason why you need the Roomba 670. The iRobot Roomba 670 is the latest in the very popular 600 series of Roomba's robot vacuums. Thus, maybe me being the robot vacuum that you purchase that'll help you with all your household cleaning needs. Now, once connected to a Wi-Fi connection, you can control your iRobot from your smartphone. Maybe you're out and about, you're shopping, and company's coming over, and you want to make sure that your place is uh, spick and span. Easy peasy. All you do is touch it from your smartphone, tell it to clean, and it'll do it while you are away. Or maybe you're relaxing at home, you're laying on the couch, you can tell your iRobot to uh, clean via your Amazon Echo device or your Google Assistant voice command and it'll start cleaning while you stay right on the couch. Now the iRobot 670 is one of the only vacuums to have two levels of cleaning brushes to add into its technology. Now the two cleaning brushes, one is to loosen up the dirt and the other is to pick it up. Now it even has dirt detection sensors to know where the high traffic areas are in your room. So say goodbye to all your pet hair, dirt, dust, or anything that's laying on the floor. This thing is going to pick it up. Now once you start this thing, don't feel like you have to babysit it. It's got all kinds of sensors around it that it knows exactly where to go. So you don't have to worry about putting up a baby gate or preventing it from going down the stairs. If it gets to an edge of the steps, it will stop because it knows all through the sensors that are all around the robot. So in this video, I'm going to show you it. I'm going to show you how it works in action um, and how I change the name of this thing because you don't want to call it like Roomba. Uh, you want to give it a real name and so I did so in this video we're going to talk about what I did and show you exactly how it works all right so let's go from here to my home and that way you guys can see so this is the iRobot Roomba I like the color scheme I went with the white and black that's just kind of my favorite color preference when it comes to devices and stuff and if you guys are interested in one of these I'll have a description of where you can buy this down below but I've been pleasantly surprised at how well it performs. Um, I'm a big tech guy where I love uh, technology and anything that makes life a lot easier. It's almost like we're living in a Jetson age when I'm using one of these things. It does a pretty good job. Now one of the cool features that this has is that you can change its name because I mean who wants to name it Roomba? 
Uh, so I changed it to Sheila. My wife recommended we change it to Sheila. So whenever we need to access it in the app, it says Sheila. But it's very user friendly to use. I mean, you download the app, the iRobot Home app, and then you just follow along the prompts. It's very easy to set up. It took me like maybe uh, just a few minutes to do it, two, three minutes. When you first get it started, it takes about three hours to get it charged up on the very first go round. But after that, it, it, it tends to hold a battery charge fairly long. Vacuuming robot. The cool thing about this is that you can integrate it with one of your Alexa devices. And since I did change the name to it as Sheila, whenever I tell Alexa to... Hold on, let me turn off my Alexa device. Every time I say her name, she keeps going off. Alright, so every time I ask Alexa to tell Sheila to go clean, she understands that it's a uh, the iRobot whenever I call her Sheila and then she'll even respond back to it as Sheila so that's kind of a cool little integration but what's really cool is how we're able to even uh, voice command it without even touching the thing we can or, or even going onto our app uh, you can just voice command through one of your Amazon Echoes but one of the best ways that I've learned to see if a product works is to see it in action so here are some clips of Sheila or iRobot Roomba in action Alexa, tell Roomba to go home. I will send Sheila home. It may not find the dock if it is in another room. Thanks for checking out this video guys and if you guys want to buy one of these like I mentioned before I have a description of where you can get one of these down below. Um, iRobot Roomba 670 series pretty good buy. Make sure you guys subscribe for more of these tech review kind of videos and until the next video be creative.